I'm Sir Tap Tap, and welcome to Let's Play Crimson Room by Toshimitsu Takaki. Takagi. I drank too much last night. I thought what time it is now. I felt thirst of the throat. The bed was different from usual. Is this a hotel? No, it does not seem to be a hotel. I am shut up. I have to escape. <laughs> a crimson ceiling and a wall. So after playing Crimson, um, Crimson Room Decade, it's, it's a good old sound, I thought I'd play this again. Um, unfortunately, the only playable place I've found it on is E-Bomb's World. If you're not familiar, we don't like E-Bomb's World. Um, CD was got. This good old English. I'd forgotten about that. Um, it is a stale CD player. Well, let's get a CD. Should have expected that. The knob does not turn. It is a strong door. It has no it has no strange thing. Something is in the window frame. The good old JPEG. Look at that JPEG. So this is a uh if you notice, this is a 2004 room escape flash game. Small key. Two keys. There's no strange thing. Um so this is one of probably most people's first uh, room escape games. We got a box. We got a power supply. Power cord. Okay, Parker, please. Not now. Um, so let's play the... Oh, right. We don't have a CD. Nothing happens. I can't do anything with that yet. Oh, we got a ring. Okay. So, uh, oh. So this is probably the most famous, by a lot, Room Escape series. I, there's a lot more games to it, I think. Oops. <laughs> that dramatic sound effect. We have a battery, we've got a ring. Um, I look under the bed. Didn't actually mean to look over here. Can I look behind the thing? No. But uh, yeah, Room Escapes, I, I think everybody's pretty familiar with. Parker, please. This is one of the Flash classics, so I thought, in addition to, you know, just being um, related to the Crimson Room Decade, which I did a week ago, does that... The hole waited for the ring. Oh, that's some good English. Um, I sort of non-ironically enjoy English. It's just something endearing. There is no strange thing. Ah, uh, good. This is the part where we don't know what's going on. Wait, wait. We have a cassette. Never mind. We don't need a CD. We have a cassette. Good old cassette. Put the switch on. Oh, it's a CD player, not a cassette. Er, Parker? CD player, not a cassette player, so I can't put that in. We have a key. We don't we seem to have run out of things to put keys into, though. So that's unfortunate. Tiny glass plate. Can't open those. There's no strange thing. Um, Nothing behind. How do I get back behind the bed? Get get behind the bed again, is it? Ugh. Okay. Rubescape games can devolve into pixel hunting on occasion. How do I look up? One sort of frustrating thing is in, in this game, I'm not sure like where to transition screens. Can I look under? I already looked under. Alright, so I have a I have a key. Don't tell me I can unlock this one. I doubted it. Yeah, I I didn't think so. So, wait, what is this? Tachism history. Okay. Um, not sure if this website still works. It's been a long time. www. Remember when everyone still read out the HTTP? Parker, please. Those were sad times. Datacraft.co. Parker, please. JP slash tack gives them slash rr slash history dot htm yep server can't find what's at that url that's why i'm not really a fan of linking things in games parker please um to urls and stuff because you know, I'm, I am playing this 12 years after its release, but it's a very important, like, historical, basically, game. 
So, um... Would you... Um... See, it's kind of important that it's still playable, in my opinion. I'm not actually sure if that is, like, a super necessary thing. Hmm. There's no strange thing. But why do we have this whole wall? We have, a, we have a whole wall, and we have a flashlight, or a battery, which is usually a hint that there's a flashlight somewhere. So, yeah, this is the part where you have to just hunt for pixels, I'm sorry. Um, hmm. How do I get back to that? No! It is so hard to get to that corner. And there's, like, no indication that you're going to get that corner. No. There is nothing. There is no strange thing. Lift up the bed! Well, maybe there really isn't anything. Um, hmm. I may have to look something up because the window won't open. Wait, can I examine? Can I put the battery in there? Put the CD in there. The lid is not open. About items. An ordinary battery. Cassette tape which has not been played. Stale CD player. Hmm. I think I've played this before, but I don't... There is no strange thing. Yeah, I may have to look up a teeny tiny hint or just keep poking around or... This wall is way too suspicious. But nothing seems to work. Can I can I do the old tab button trick? No, no, I can't. Hmm. Let me keep poking around here for a second. Uh, so is there Oh god damn it. What is that? No what is that? So you can look in the crease. So can I look behind the bed too? No. That's so dumb. Can I look under the thing? It, it, these games have a tendency to do some dumb things. Oh, in in Crimson Room Decade, um, you had to do the yeah, yeah. Crimson Room Decade actually makes that a bit more reasonable. A thick ring was got. All right. Wait, is that... is that for this? Oh, okay. Nothing happens. Put on a second battery. Is this a camera? Oh, it's a projector. Okay. Aw, oh, yes. Aw, oh, yes. Got some... Some... Some silent step. Some 20s step. Is that all that does? That is all that does. That's all that does. Um, I have two batteries. That can't seriously be all that does, right? Seriously? Um... Oh, can I click him? What? No? Ugh. This has got to be a hint, right? Does he do something suspicious? Oh! Oh, for Pete's sake! It, hey! Hey! Excuse me? Was I not in the right place? To, he pointed at the thing and I clicked it. I'm calling BS on that. I have to watch this whole thing again. Why 
did it have to be so long? There's only a few seconds, I guess, but I mean, it, it's... Ugh. Hey, what the fu- What? There was a thing that opened and then it just disappeared. <sighs> right, this is an ancient game, and I mean... I guess... I don't know. But there... It should not be so... Easy to, you know, not press the right thing and then for... Oh god! Frickin'! Oh my... So I just leave this and then a thing appears? Like... Ugh. The thing about playing animations is that if I have to see an animation more than once, it better be really short. Or not block my progress. Like, do I just w let watch this whole thing and then a thing opens? Okay. Okay. Why didn't that that outline appeared before? Why didn't it, it work? Okay. Um. Don't tell me it's in this. Are there any other notes? Is there something stupid like it's behind the cassette player? Are you kidding me? It hides every time? Okay, I have a strong suspicion that whatever is in that URL is uh, the code. So I'm going to put this up for the 15th time. And I'm going to look up what said that URL. Um, Crimson Room URL. Why are you being so slow? Oh, good. My... my my internet connection died. That's great. I... Uh, are you kidding me? What is going on? Oh wait, I'm uploading a video. It may just be slow because of that. Oh my goodness. We're almost full up on items here. Yeah, you, you you do your stupid dance thing. We know. All right, this could have been like two seconds. And then if you click it while that is showing, it closes. That is, that is infuriating. I don't even get how things like this happen in games. Like, I'm sure this has been, like, complained about to death, and the creator is long since tired of hearing that, but you gotta not do things like that. Okay, so you actually have to wait for it to close. Oh my god, I clicked it twice, and then it closed. This is the most infuriating thing. Yeah, it's just because I, uh, it's slow because I was loading the thing. Um, yeah, it looks like I was supposed to find the URL. Oh, for f flipping. Plop up. Brah. Okay. It was the URL. So, take you another game window with a table in the middle of a room. Table has four chords in it. Whatever. It's supposed to open like a second game thing, but the URL is long since dead. This is, you should really think about preservation with your game and at least rehost it somewhere if it's gone from everywhere. Oh my god. If it doesn't open, Parker. Not now. 
Okay. We are at the thing. The code is apparently... Why does it... Why does it count down instead of up? It's 2290. Oh. Key? The numbers are not right. Oh, the numbers are different every time you play, but 1994 will always work. Okay. Yeah, so I... I guess there's like a different URL every time. A straight driver. What do we need a screwdriver for? Um, I don't. I don't actually recall seeing anything that a screwdriver would help with. Let's just shove the screwdriver into the machine and kill ourselves. Oh. Okay. We escaped. That was it. Okay. Was trapped because the URL that leads to the ending died. So you actually have to use a walkthrough to beat this game in 2016. That's unfortunate. Ugh. And I this website I think is dead now. It's datacraft. Oh, it doesn't. It's not even a link. Yep, it's dead. So... That is Crimson Rune, the original. It's... Well, very simple by today's standards, but then Roomscapes are never... Well, there are some longer ones now, but uh, the whole point was a nice, mysterious, you know... 10 minutes to a half hour of, depending on how long you clunk your head against walls. Yeah, that is, that is an original classic. I don't, I'm actually not sure anymore if that website couldn't load because of my internet issues or the URL. Up, oh, yep, sure enough, the, this, I went to the URL, I, I, I was having internet issues earlier, but uh, you just get this, which is... I'm pretty sure this is not the uh, code to go there. So yeah, this is like, this must have been a free website. Like websites were like crazy expensive, you know, way back in 2014. It's a lot easier to uh, make your own thing now, or you could like host things on itch.io. That could actually, you could make a game on itch.io and host like a hint that goes to require you to play another game on itch.io. And that would work, but uh an annoying thing about the internet is how things can, you know, disappear. And, uh... Well, it's kind of nice to have Flash games just all self-contained. And, uh, I don't really fear Newgrounds or Congregate disappearing anytime soon, but... Which is what, I, was this never uploaded to Newgrounds or Congregate? Because I searched both of those. Those were my first stop, actually. Uh, they didn't have this. I... I'm pretty sure I played this around when it came out, but I don't remember where, and I don't remember if it had its own website that is now dead, or it's, I don't know, it's one for the internet archaeologists. This is unfortunately sort of hard to find the history of, because everything's missing now, which is why it's kind of important to have videos of games um, out there, too, so you, like, especially recorded, like, with the zeitgeist, because then you could know... Like, if something did or didn't work way back when, you would know. Because, you know, if if there was a Let's Play from 2004 that, you know, had that website, there's apparently a little mini-game you're supposed to play it, at this URL that no longer works. But, uh, I'm just rambling. That was Crimson Room. It is a very short, but it is sort of a classic. Um, there's a bunch more Crimson Room style games by the same dev. I'll see if I can find some of them that actually work, and maybe I'll play some.